on Saturday. And again, most of the day will be dry and warm, and then the thunderstorms fire up along that cold front by the end of the day on Saturday. So all modes of severe weather will be possible Saturday afternoon, Saturday night. Today at 3 o'clock, it will be dry if you do have outdoor plans. Things will be changing right around 8, 9, 10 p.m. with some thunderstorms pushing in from the south. This is all heavy rainfall and some rumbles of thunder at this time Friday. Friday afternoon will be dry and it looks completely dry Friday night and that's when it will be warm and windy and it will be warm again on Saturday as well. And then that cold front comes through late in the day, really changes things up and triggers some stronger storms by Saturday night. Now this system late tonight, early tomorrow morning will drop around an inch to two inches of rainfall in some communities. Saturday night, those storms will push out. The cooler air moves in, but it does look dry on Sunday, Monday, and it looks dry most of next week with temperatures back below average. Today, it will be heating up 68. That dense fog lifting, then some sunshine. Tonight, 53 with those scattered storms moving in from